Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Experts on the Solid Pods where we talk down all the international and local sports here in the Bahamas, international, worldwide. Here we are, back again. You know what's good. Showtime, alongside your boy, X Factor. Yeah, this is your boy, CJ, the X Factor. Now, coming to y'all again. Now, we got a hot week. Oops. We got a hot week of sports coming up. We're going to break down, what, week four of the NFL. And then training camp is opening up for the NBA. We can bring that to you. And also, I hope these guys have been watching, but I've been watching the WNBA Finals starring our own Bahamian, uh, what they call it now, the Bahamian Beast, uh, John Quell Jones. Uh, don't forget, we got Sanzo in the mix. Sanzo yes, sir. Him up, yo. Yes, sir. Sanzo in the building. Uh, we will be talking about everything that X Factor mentioned. And let's just start off with the NFL right quick, week four. What did y'all think of the games this week? Horrible. They was trash. Why? Especially fantasy wise. Everybody was fumbling the ball, everybody had low yardage. Like, guys, like, boy, what's going on this week? Like, boy, I ain't like. The games to me was sloppy. I I just didn't there, enjoy football this week. There were no really exciting games. No, Not like week nothing three. Nothing was really exciting. But I, it, it wasn't exciting. But what is impressive to me is the fact that the Cleveland Browns was able to get things together. Uh, that was an impressive win. Yeah, it was an impressive mm. win. Forty to twenty-five. I feel as though okay. uh, Odell and those guys are gonna get things together. Odell had five yards. Have a playoff run. Uh, obviously, you didn't watch the game because Odell. Had multiple catches with multiple yards. Odell is on my fantasy team, and the man scored 0. 0.5 because he had five yards. I'm telling you, Odell, I don't know how they got all them points, but it sure wasn't because of Odell. But the good thing is, I don't know why, like, I don't think he's gelling like that into that offense yet, but when he does, they can be crazy. It's going to take some time. But most of that points came from the running back. What's your boy name? Chubb? He Chubb. Had a career, he had a career date. Chubb had a very really good yeah, game. Yeah, yeah. Um, it could take some time. But again, like we've been saying before. But if, yeah, Odell had 20 yards. 20. Huh? Like we've been saying before. If if they find a way to <laughs> if they find a way to work him in, Odell, uh, Chubb, you got laundry. And if if, if we could, they could find a way to... Chuku. Chuku nice too. Yeah. If and he, then hopefully when Kareem Hunt come back. And when Kareem Hunt come back, that's another weapon. He could, he could uh, be a second a line. Nah, like it's a lot of eagles, right? But if they could find a way to make that work, then we may see them in the, in the AFC Championship. So I know they played the Baltimore Ravens, and uh, people was trying to figure out if Lamar Jackson is who they thought he was, and mm-hmm. uh, what is he about. What you think about his play, Sanzo? Uh, you, you, you had a sub bar game. He was thoroughly obliterated by Baker Mayfield. Um, and this is actually his second week in a row being outplayed by um by a, by a quarterback. I mean, he's outplayed by Mahomes. Mahomes outplays everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mahomes so, is one of the best. You can't, yeah. so, can't forget about Mahomes. Except Tom Brady. So uh, he can play him too Mahomes. when time comes. I can tell you what, Tom Brady still got it. Still got uh, it. Yeah, he all right. <laughs> that yeah. boy still he, got it. He does more with less. Yeah. yeah. That's it. But, um, Lamar Jackson, um, he, he had a good start to the season, obviously, right? Yeah. But um, I guess um, these last two weeks showing us that, you know, don't be so quick to elevate him into that top tier yet. You know what I mean? I know some people was freaking out, all right? You know, he ain't a running back. He's a quarterback. And I know he's, he's really aiming to show people a lot. But at the end of the day, you know, still work to be done. I don't think he's in that top tier yet where he wants to be. But that boy ain't even in the second tier. Right? So he needs to do more work. I guess. You're right, you're right. What yeah. what about uh Kyler Murray? Uh is he is he maybe not living up to the hype? Nope. As projected or does he need some time to grow or is it too it did, did they put him in too early? To yeah. have a franchise carry the franchise name? They didn't have no choice cuz technically they didn't have no other sensible quarterback there. Uh, Josh Rosen, you see what he's doing in Miami, so they had to get rid of him. But it, 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 it usually be a problem when you have a rookie come into the league and they go straight into starting. Like, you don't see much rookies come out of college, go straight into starting at the NFL level and be good. 
That's why people like Mahomes, it's be good for them to sit behind a quarterback for a year or two. Yeah, some season. People like Tom Brady, it's right, good right. to sit behind. People yeah, like Drew man. Brees, it was good to sit behind. It's because it gives you that time to develop and and get your footing before you just go to, out there. Especially when you're in with a good yeah. team. If you only get a good offense or a good already system built around you and they just put you out there and the team is trash and you're just trying to make something happen, your career is... In shambles. And don't worry, and don't forget also, Murray had a lot of questions coming into the draft. You know, yes. people people were trashing this style of play where he could thrive. And he too small. In the NFL, and he too small. You know, and only one small quarterback could be thriving, and that's Russell Wilson, if you want to say he's thriving. And uh, Mahomes, Mahomes is kind of... And Mahomes is... But yeah. Mahomes is still bigger than Mahomes, that dude. Yeah, though. Mahomes is a little bigger. Yeah, but so... What do Ma- you think about the impressive win from the Buccaneers? I mean, the Buccaneers played the Rams... <laughs> uh, they well, scored 55 points. I've been saying, right, James Winston really making me proud this year. Uh, how you approaching the game. Mm. Considering... You buy something new to come to game in there. Them last couple of years, play the last couple of years, James Winston, he was probably the worst quarterback in the league. Fit definitely top, top three worst quarterbacks. Mm. Eli Manning retired. He, James Winston was... He was not worse than Eli, but he's like in the top. bottom three. <laughs> so I right. think this year his approach... To me, it's been very refreshing to see for that Tampa Bay team. I I, I really thought dudes was going to follow him like that. But, you know, he getting it together. And, and, and like you said, and the Buccaneers, they don't have a bad team. Wait, the only reason... They, don't, they have a very good defense. Jameis Winston actually playing like sense right now. Is that it? It's because he in the contract year. It's just like basketball. Fellas, wait till they contract year and have career highs. And then when they go, you wait, let them sign him to a long-term deal and watch what he do next year. Nah, I never say they should He'll do lead that. the league again in interceptions. You think they should <laughs> trade in their quarterback? Or what? Uh, if I was them, I wasn't resign them. I hope he gets no, another I, job someplace I, I wasn't, else. I, I wouldn't want him, him out of the league. But I think he played he good enough. No, on. no, he played very good enough to get another job. Another yeah. team will take a gamble on him. But so, I don't think they should resign. Probably like that. I know you guys mentioned the Kyler Washington Murray situation and how he's a rookie. Yeah. Uh, what you think about the Jones, the, the the Jones fella from Giants? Is he playing unexpectedly well? He's or? playing above yeah. expectation. For now. It's almost like the, still gotta give it time. the Garoppolo saga when uh, the starting quarterback is not there and then this, new, this young, hot quarterback comes in and he pieces out like... The three game span, four game span, but after a while they cool down. Yeah. Because back in the day, you could have you could have had a longer stretch coming off the bench because a technology back then wasn't as advanced. Now today, the second you have a good game, fellas, them just after the game over, fellas, them done rewinding back. But he making these type of throws. Okay, he always looking left. Okay, he don't roll. He don't like to roll his like. So by the time the next game come around, fellas, them picking on your weakness. Okay, he can't throw deep. Okay, you don't like throw across the middle. He only throwing these little flares. Now nah, they covering that. They making you throw deep, and all you throwing is interception. I'll, so it, it can start to come. He can start to come back it, down. It, there, no, it, 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 could be, it could be a medium. It could be nice. It could be a medium. Um, but thing is, um, you got to give the Giants credit, and I never thought I'd give Gettleman any credit. But hey, he targeted Daniel Jones. He said that was his man, and it looked stupid at the time. But like I tell people, but you can't just look at analytics and all the time. But you no. have to be a combination. No, definitely not. You have to look at analytics and I eye test. Or... But so, at the end of the day, the, the front offices would really did well in making the decisions, and <laughs> I I give them uh, a plus for that. And and look at compared to Dwayne Haskins, who everybody was saying they should have dropped. Oh, that being a tight now. Don't don't do that. You know what I mean? Being a tight. So I mean. Washington and Demi, yeah. Uh, yeah, he, I mean, he, he's I mean, in a scrape, every, but every, everybody's trying to figure out here in this NFL season is when are the Dolphins gonna win their first game? Oh, don't stop! Thank you. Know these behemoths now. Uh, everybody going t- crazy. You can hit the wrong nerve now. People washing their cars <laughs> with the Dolphins gear and shirts and stuff like that. Everybody trying to figure out when the Dolphins is gonna win their first game. Uh, we, we try, we still trying to figure out if there's NFL team still. Wow. Whoever they playing this week. Uh, I think they is it Baltimore. No, what are they playing? No, they already played Baltimore. Baltimore's place they had open game one. They playing the Chargers. Oh, that's that's smoke. I thought they just played the Chargers. No, they. You sure? No, my bad. They just played the Chargers. They playing the Redskins. Oh. Well, that's gonna be a great that's, game. That's a real gully wash game. Because at the end of the day, uh, the head coach of the uh, the Redskins is on the on the back ropes. No saying when he's gonna. 
Wait, so they, they didn't, they didn't. They ain't playing no Redskins. I just guessed myself. The Patriots playing the Redskins. No way. They playing the Redskins on Sunday. The Patriots are playing the Washington Redskins. I know my team. All right. That's so they must see. The, they want to buy me. They want to buy me. They playing the Redskins. The next week. The next week. Yeah, but either way, you put the late, Dolphins are in trouble. Yeah, that's a win. That's a win for them this week. They, they yeah, that's a, a win. They get a week off. The, the fact that they are not playing, that's a win. That's a win. I mean, I just look at these scores. If you don't lose, you win. If, this is embarrassing, right, ladies and gents. This is embarrassing. I don't think TV could do this any justice. I mean, these niggas getting I, beat I on average by oh dirty. My, I think I, I didn't need to bring something else on TV. I mean, I I hate, yeah, but one yeah, thing with me, I mean, like our cable, but I know we little off topic, but our cable package is crap, boy. Like we gotta stop letting CBS play Dolphin game yeah, every Sunday. I, I was to the barber. Like, be mad, bro. I was to the barber on it's Sunday, atrocious. and they go and turn on the Dolphin game. I said, but y'all gotta change that. Like this don't every make no Sunday, sense this. it's Dolphins automatic. Yo, got he changed that, boy? Don't make no sense watching this. And sure enough, they did change that. Because at the end of the day, you got to look at... You can't be getting beat this bad. Zero to 43 in one week. I T- mean, 10 that's, to 59. That's a big game. But anyway, the Dolphins, yeah, we know the Dolphins is trash. But let's go to people who actually have some hope of try- trying to win. Uh, let's cross over to the NBA where... Everybody is zero and zero now, so everybody thinks that they have a chance at a championship, unless you like the Knicks or something. But yeah, everybody think they win the a championship this year. Uh, they got videos out now. People hitting training camp. You got Zion them there throwing alley oops. Um, you got Kawhi playing with his teammates, even though Paul George is still injured. Like I told people, that's why this is not going to be as good as they thought it was going to be. Um, he coming back. No Anthony Davis is there him. saying that he likes the centers that he plays with because Dwight Howard and McGee is making it hard for guys to score in the paint. Uh, LeBron trying to play point guard. Uh, you got Westbrook and Harden friggin' shooting one leg, three pointers in China, be- blowing people up by sixty points. It's like, but the NBA, the NBA shaping up the beer. This look like the most balanced season in about let's say about five, six years because you don't have a one dominant team that you could say, but they get into the finals. Like the past five years, you could say, but Golden State get into the finals regardless. Right. Now, mm-hmm. you can't even pick out of the West or out of the East a deadlock team to say, but they could be in the finals. It's, it's, it's going to be a, level, a lot of level pick for it. I, I don't see, obviously, I don't see the Lakers losing this championship here. Uh, well, this is a big season for LA, though. JJ Reddick told uh we'll go there, JJ Reddick told Zion Williamson that he's thirteen for thirteen. He's never lost. Oh, I mean he's never he's not been to the playoffs. Who mode speed out of space. <laughs> I, never, I didn't like, even realize that that like, a, you yeah, he could have done JJ Reddick. I didn't realize he had a record. Wait, which, which team he Kobe carried Bryant to the playoffs? isn't thirteen for thirteen. Tell me which team he carried to the playoffs. Well, he's a star on all them teams. Which team he carried to the playoffs? He, he, he ride them. every last one of them teams. No, man. No, you cannot, no, no, you cannot say the man you ride them. Ride, ride, ride is a Robert Ory type of situation. Oh, I wouldn't even say Robert Ory. Robert Ory wants to promote now. Because at least Robert Ory could get there and win. No, he's yeah. been, he been brag, but he's been there 39. How much, how much rings he gets since he's been there? Oh, 13 he, of them. Listen, now. he gets his players 13 times. That's an NBA record. How much and times has he even been to the finals? And he start on them teams. And how much times has he even been to the finals since he won't brag? But he's 13 for 13. Well, he's the only one who got a record. That means he's 0 for 13 when it comes to rings. <laughs> That's <laughs> he's all that means. He's the only one who got a record, so Fox, I had to brag too. Fox. It is what it is. So you know at the end of the day, they, that's what the man doing. 13 for the, the, the rookie. Say, listen. If I Zion, I had to look at it like, big brother. Zion got to respect you. I had to look at it like, but you can have Zion got to respect you. He, he do get this. But um, this this will be an interesting season. And I and you got, I, I already said, you got like at least seven teams, six or seven teams in the West. Who, if they get eliminated in the first round, they mod. They flicking mod, and they ready to flick and make some major trades. So someone got to get eliminated. I think this trade deadline could be could be a big one this year because where everybody get these big tools and these dynamic duels, everybody can be looking for that third piece. Everybody can be trying to trade for either that Bradley Beal piece to add to their dynamic two or that, that extra piece to add to Giannis because Giannis can this year, Giannis ain't gonna do it by himself. Yeah, someone need a free flicking Devin Booker, but you all free that man. 
No, but they got a nice team now. They got yeah. Devin Booker, they got Ricky Rubio, they got DeAndre really? Ayton. Really? Okay. So, Free that man. I mean, I say they win it, nothing. Free that man. They in a horrible division. So let me ask you a quick question. That division? Free that man and Free Ayton, too. Let me ask you a question. Free Ayton next. Suns make playoffs this year? No. Okay, then. So they why division you tell them too don't tight. Break? So why are you telling them? You imagine Bucko and... Where you going? Imagine Giannis with a Bucko. Mm-mm. That ain't weak. What a flip. That ain't weak. Go on, cool. Go on, cool. Listen, free, all free that book, all free book, please. <laughs> um, um, yeah, but the the West could be really, really competitive. The East could be competitive too, not as competitive as the West, obviously. But the East, you still got Philly. Um, who who think they should win a championship this year? You still got Boston, who may sneak up and still be competitive. No. You still got uh, the Bucks. Obviously, yeah. they ain't going nowhere. Um. Yeah, the Bucks are a little solid. Toronto, who knows what happens with them? <laughs> Nothing. Right? Um, I still think they could compete. The real first, team or the LA, baby? Indiana. I, Indiana healthy and they Lakers. add some pizzas. Window no clothes. You know what I mean? So, it could be interesting to see how the, how, how, how the players shake out. The, in, the most interesting team to me is the Lakers, obviously, because yes. how will all the pieces fit together? What will LeBron come back? I hey. I, Guys, in his 17th year. It ain't interesting to see, like, when it comes to basketball-wise. It's just interesting to see drama-wise. Like, you know what them guys good for. You know, buddy on that team really is a rookie. They have, like, one rookie. And all the other guys, you know, like, it's how still, they It still is going to be exciting to see I everything see unfold. how the drama going to unfold. Because if things don't wake up the way it does wake up, Let's see how cry baby Bron can wiggle but, away out of this. But you know, I ask him for with, more help. With every LeBron team, you can't ask for more help than this. Bro. With ev- with every LeBron team, there's always drama. So let me ask you guys. Like, drama every let year. me ask you guys a quick question. There'll be drama every year. Is this the most help LeBron has ever received? No, no. hell no. The no. most help LeBron ever get, and he does he does get a lot of help. So let's just let's just clarify that. Okay, the I'm most I'm asking you. The you, you see the record yeah. when they say LeBron has played with the most number one picks in the NBA history? Yeah, like. Like, he had so much number one. And, that, and that's just number one picks. We ain't even talking about, like, Wade, because Wade wasn't number one. Bosch wasn't number one. Like, they just was number one picks that he played with. And then when you look at, like, all the other players who played, it be like, wait, what the hell is playoffs? Then you are, NBA, I need an extra shooter. Th- I need a playmaker. Then you also I need a big man. I also see like, the thing with, they, with some of the po- I think some of the posters last year. Damian Lillard played against more all NBA players in two years in the playoffs, <laughs> that, Le- that LeBron has played in all the flicking <laughs> in eight years to the East. That East is being job Wait, like, that East, like, wait, that I, say, wait job I really thought this is a myth. I, I say I this is a serious message. thing, boy. But anyway, I will get to off topic because you all think I go always slander LeBron. But I don't, I don't approve that message. But no, I do think the Lakers have an interesting team. LeBron will bring the drama because you know that's what he's have to do. He's have to bring the drama and disturb the team. And sometimes it's the getting... The most interesting man on television? Yeah, it's getting, motiv- it's getting motivated. You know what I mean? So it'll be interesting to see how he sprinkles his little seeds in there, you know? Because remember, when he first had gone to Cleveland, I mean, when he gone back to Cleveland, he gone put a little drama and Kevin Love in him head, you know, like, bro, you need to get it together. Da, 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 finish so Kevin Love. Finish off Kevin Love, but they get a championship. You know what I mean? So... They're going from scoring 26. And That's 15. one thing I, I look forward to for LeBron. Be Him to bring that, that controversy. Sometimes you need a nigga to bring that controversy. You know what I mean? Speaking about mental awareness. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin, Love, Kevin Love, something has to be wrong with Kevin Love. But Kevin he, Love just can't just fall off like that. LeBron has ruined them. But Who else did LeBron ruin? Bosch. Chris Bosch. Bosch Let me Bosch. ask you a question. But he bought, but don't stop. Before Bosch got a year? And he is Bobo. Wait, I ain't gonna lie. Wait, Bobo was running. I can be, I can be real. Before but, I bought, wait, before I bought, meet up with Flick and LeBron and Wade. So LeBron, you can make the argument Bosch was just as hard as Wade. No, let me ask you a question. You so, can make the argument Bosch let me ask you question. killing, but so LeBron like put that. Guy. So LeBron put that. Uh, the blood clot in Bosch heart. That's crazy. Because y'all made it seem like LeBron <laughs> just and Bosch career. He did. Wait, let me show you something. All that may be related for you, you know. Think about it. All that stress. I, listen, I ain't getting it done. Think about it. No, but th- show it. Think about it. Seriously. All that may be related. Bosch started playing center when he going to join LeBron. He, he had to play center. Kill him right over. Right? He might Lousy take a couple... Haslam. Of, but how Haslam been in the Miami Heat almost 20 years? He might have take a couple elbow to each ass. What the fuck? Haslam's one of the luckiest niggas in... in like, but that's, 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 a, that's a, exactly that's what it all about. He take a couple elbow to each ass and probably get a black lot from there. Oh, you, you think Kyrie I mean? them had to push up? Kyrie's like, but I can't play underneath this boy. But the same making no sense. This boy trying to kill my career. 
I got them crazy too, though. What do y'all think Brooklyn could do? Um, Brooklyn made the playoffs. Let's say that. Once they healthy. I mean, once Kyrie stay healthy. Once Kyrie stay healthy. Brooklyn will make the playoffs in the East. Brooklyn nah. doesn't make playoffs. Kevin Durant doesn't play. Well, if Kevin don't play, no. it don't matter. No, he ain't playing. He ain't playing this year. Well, that, that's how I feel. He ain't playing this year. So I, year. I like to watch the, the, the story. Like I tell fellas, I like to watch the, the inside. I like the basketball aspects, but I like to watch the behind the scenes where Kyrie is telling how him and KD made the decision to come to Brooklyn and they didn't even talk to the ownership. Like, ownership wake up that morning and is like, but they ain't coming out speak because we ain't even talk to these fellas. And then, like, Durant was just like, I'm going to Brooklyn. Like, it's like, that's crazy. That's hell? impossible like, because the they hell? had a meeting like, really? previously with no. Jay-Z. They did. Kyrie and Jay-Z is not even the owner of Brooklyn. No, he, no not the owner. He they had a meeting owner. with no, Jay-Z. Kyrie, yeah, that's, Kyrie, that's had told, Kyrie had already told Brooklyn from when he season ended. Yeah, he's but like, they didn't know he was getting okay. KD. No, they don't didn't know he was getting KD. They didn't know he was getting KD, but Kyrie told them. But don't make it seem like it was a new United They know they were getting Kyrie. That's why they let Russell. They wasn't really too hard about yeah. Russell. And he's like, but listen, guys, there's a chance we could get someone else. So KD, um, KD and Kyrie and DeAndre Jordan talk on the Skype or whatever DeAndre, the case may be. I don't know where the hell they find him. And they're just like, boy, let's do this. We're going to do this now. Let's do this. It's amazing to, It's amazing that it's advanced, the NBA is advanced to this point. And obviously, you could blame LeBron for it. It's just, you know. Right? That people will knowingly be tampering for like a whole Let me ask year. You this, what can LeBron be blamed for? Well, we, uh, I, well, well, let me give LeBron some credit for this. All right, then. I, give, I give LeBron some credit for this, right? Yeah, let me hear you. Right? Yeah. But, so, LeBron, recently on the on his HBO show, the, um, the shop or whatever the case may be, yeah. he, had, oh, he had the governor of California on, and the governor of California did sign a bill allowing NCAA players to be paid for their... That's what you give LeBron credit Their for. image and their likeness. I give LeBron credit for giving them a the platform. Yeah, man, that, 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 no, listen. All you do is put more money in, in, in Jordan and, and, and Nautica Han because you can give young fellas straight out of high school. I mean, I'm saying they shouldn't be paid, right? No, they definitely but should you know be paid. They, they definitely money, should be paid. Anything you do... Yeah, they can do <laughs> it with <laughs> the money. They only can stimulate the economy, no, no, no. bro. Anything they, you do... They, they, listen they to me. No, 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 no. Anything you should... Listen to me. Anything you do in this life, you should be compensated for. Yep. Yep. If you can't do it like nobody else could, you should be going yeah, to before. Yeah. It ain't made no sense. Yeah. It ain't made no sense to them niggas flicking girl in the college and they can't make no yeah, money off their image and their money. likeness. So quick question. What you guys think about the whole uh, Lonzo Ball shooting around, getting his threes together, getting his arc, changing his form? What, what's up it's with that? It's only a matter of time before you do it because that form, what he had coming to the league, couldn't work. Be trash. What about, no, the, what what about better, Baby so. Bro? Baby Bro is selected. It might be selected number one. Mello How you feel about that? Baby Bro is always the best, best one of all them. Easily, easily. Yeah. Baby Bro is always the best one of all them. He, so let me ask you. He got uh, the most skill out of all them. That so, far one should have never so even tried. Will, will, will it be first round, first pick? I, I, I say all that now. I don't think it will be the first pick. I think politics could prevent him getting picked first. Because um, people still don't like LeVar. And then he coming from... Australia, right? Australia, that's where he is. Fox. Politics um, could cost him not get picked first. He, Unle- he have a chance. Unless he get blow unless he blow away yeah. competition over there. But if he just killing it, killing it, killing it, like he is doing now, because he is killing it. He'll get top ten. But yeah, he probably get and top if five. I, him, I wouldn't want to be he first probably get pick, top five. To be honest with you. Because first pick always has the harder road. If you get first pick like people like Jam around. When you get picked that top one, two, and three, you end up getting to Memphis and stuff like that, but your career could be over in like four years if you ain't in the right That's system. That's right. I'm trying to show you free my boy Aiden. But... And he go and he go to a team which just need a point guard or a Barker point guard or a good guard, solid guard. You could put him someplace like, I don't know, even if you go to Phoenix. I you think, could go to Phoenix and fit in at the two. I, I think for him especially, he need he need a, a good structured team because if he go to a team where he just could run wild or whatever. Can't go to whatever, the Pelicans. Then... No, I, 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 you ain't with all that. Then yeah, they can bring that flicking better. Facebook show to New Orleans, and you ain't want to flicking that. So, but yeah, I think he could be nice, but I read it up, but he could but be all nice. these superstars and stuff that I got to say that uh, Russell Westbrook is in the whole the most. I doubt it. As what, the most pressure? As the most nothing. He has absolutely nothing to work with. What, this year? Yeah. All them, all them shooters he got in Houston. It's the best team Russell Westbrook been on since Durant leave him. 
Like, you ain't a no better team than this. Yeah, this better team. Hey, this you remember this team they get Paul up. George? Like, Paul it, George came in injured, ex- and then they hey, get Melo. Hey, hey, hey. Melo come there and listen, stink up the whole show. Listen, exactly is, what, exactly is what I wanted you to say. So, Russell Westbrook shouldn't have no excuse. Why? But y'all got to realize that. But I feel Houston, it. Houston, the power ranking shows that the number one team is the LA Clippers. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. I could agree with that. The number four team? I definitely don't agree with that. Well, 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 hold on, hold on. Well, so what you trying to say? Who? Who should be the number one team then? But you can't go no friggin' LA Clippers to be no number one team. There so they who, are. who would you say? Of course, right now, the number one team is the Lakers. What? You can't go with Fake no news. Clippers to be no number one team. Fake news. Because number two. Next. Number one, Paul George in healthy. So how could they come? If they go, if they, if they was having opening night where the Lakers play the Clippers, Lakers would be them by 20 points easily. So what about the Milwaukee Bucks? What about the 76ers? Where you rank them? They in the same place they is on the ranking. Two and three. You put the Lakers in first, you put the Clippers in fourth. Simple. And they have no big man. How you could put a team... They have Montrez bro. Who? Who? So with these no-name fellas who... That nigga was beasting out last season. playoffs. See, they just... Okay, they just have one or two little series and stuff and they get their name in the books. Last season, And you season, expect actually. to put them up against Anthony Davis, bro? Last season. He's Dwight been. Howard? But Even Jabail McGee, I'll put him up again. Never, never. Stop it, stop it, stop well, it. Stop, stop it. it. Jabail McGee has stop had it. two of the best seasons of his career when? in the last two years. When? But playing with the Warriors. Okay. Jabail right. McGee. Anybody go to the Warriors. playing in the Lakers. Anybody could have gone to the Warriors that year and played good. Uh-oh. Play with the Lakers. Okay, he played he play decent with the Lakers. Yeah. Okay, he and he's still there. He played play even better Lakers. this year. He plays role, rebound, and pass. He played decent. Get it off the rim. Yes, I can't I can't wait. Uh... Season is in training camp right now. I can't wait till season starts. I see Houston played my a Chinese game the other day. They freaking not dead right off. Yeah. Uh, Houston is my sleeper team in the West. I think if them niggas could Sleep is correct. Fig- figure to put it out all together, then they have a chance to go far. Yeah, man. Definitely. Um, I, th- I think they could really run up. My sleeper team. I don't like watching James Harden play. My sleeper team is, believe it or not, Toronto. To do what? Would you I, I feel as though they, they, they they'd come back and make. Uh, well, obviously, they're not projected to win NBA Finals no. anymore. They're probably the best team in Canada. Nigga, see, it's the best. <laughs> over over, the, over, the, ma- over the Maple Leafs? Here's, here's my bold prediction for the Raptors. I don't know you expect the Raptors to Here's my bold prediction for the Raptors. The Raptors, yeah, are gonna, you the Raptors are going to finish. Can I record this? Yeah, you can record it. The Raptors are, Raptors are going to finish with a top four seed in the East. That's my I agree. bold prediction. Yes, the boy who's still waiting Van on, Fleet? on Mark Elfolds to play. He'll he finish with a top four seed in the East. Wow. <laughs> Right, yeah. Speaking of folks, where folks is, boy? He's somewhere for you to shoot. Boy. Somewhere, he's somewhere for you to shoot. Where, what are you doing? Folks going to start in Orlando and he's going to have a good season. Okay. That's a nice well, prediction. That's over two already. That's a nice <laughs> prediction. <laughs> he could write them two off. So that's my that's my prediction <laughs> for the Raptors. The Raptors was. Uh, my bold prediction LA Lakers win NBA Finals. LeBron and NBA. I mean, I'll start a bold prediction. MVP. If they favorites. Hey, who's the favorites? Then? Who they f- favorites? They are favorites. Them niggas ain't no damn favorites. Go on, Vegas. We ain't talking about no little crap, little power rankings. We talking about Vegas. Vegas is tell you it's the favorite because that's where your money gets. Listen, at the end of the day, Vegas has At the end of the day, whoever your source is, Vegas if you believe it. in Vegas, then you believe in Boy, Vegas. I believe if the Vegas. NBA sent out something and I read it and they say this is the number one team, that's then I it's the number that's one that's team. Do not come tell me about any Vegas. Okay. Put your money down. Did the NBA have Toronto the number one team last year? Got your money losing. No, right? Okay then. Well, we know injuries and stuff oh, is happening. Boy. So you got you got, you got to be fair. Oh. And trades is happening along you know the way. So, trades is happening so, every day. So, and y'all make bold predictions. So they injuries are... Know what well, he, the, that's the man. That's, my, that's what the my bold prediction is. You asked me my bold prediction. That's my bold prediction is... What happened? What's your bold prediction? Uh, my bold prediction is... Let me see who coming up these. My bold prediction could be... 70. Hmm. Six. Sirs. Oh. The uh, East. The East really is trash. You I say can't, 76 I can't even pick a good team. I think, I think, I think 76 is coming out of East for you. I think 76 is coming out of East. It's hard to say Giannis. Yeah, Giannis don't have no well, you might, you yeah, might have, 76 is coming out of East. You, got, you might have to leave. I think 76 is coming out of East. Yeah, 76 is coming. Because there's only a shorter way last year. Only because Kawhi tried to rock from the left. Yeah. He, he had that and you could argue that they got better, but... Even though you still really can't see it, yeah, but they, that's what it is all about, guys. We can't wait until the NBA season starts. Yeah, preseason, preseason, season, season finals. I can't wait. Next year, June, 
We'll be right here. Talking it up, saying yeah. how the LA Lakers will be playing the 76ers. Talking about LeBron at all the help again. And still uh, it is what it is. Then at the end of the day. Then they come talking about, oh, he had a pinky. He had a career injury. Oh, that's why he Obviously, went. we got a hater. We got one. We got one nasty watch party next year. Yeah, but kind of stink up my team. It is what it is. Hopefully, they send him back to Cleveland and he can Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us on another episode of The Experts. Um, just want to shout out John Gray Jones for beasting out Definitely. in the playoffs. Definitely. How could I forget that 32 points last night? Oh boy! Well, three um, bonds, three blocks. John Grell Jones. Uh, Here for the series of one-one. We love you. So uh, shout out John Grell. Mm-hmm. Uh, Next game on Sunday. We wish you the Saturday. best of luck. We had to take advantage because yeah. I watched the game. After that, Della Dawn. After Della gone, that was it. Yeah, yeah she 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 showed up. Most people opinion. regard Della Dawn as the best player. Double digit the, rebounds. The WNBA. She is the, the reigning MVP. So and she does get buckets. Yeah, for John yeah. Grell to really match her on that stage. It's big for being an athlete, just big for athlete in general. So again, shout out John Grell. She has a chance to be the shout out John Grell Jones all the way from the experts yeah. here in Nassau, Bahamas. This year. Shout out, yeah. baby girl. Keep yeah, doing your thing. Keep doing your thing. We can support you. Yep. You know what I mean? Bring home that trophy. The and why? Don't support me. Why don't we have watch parties? Because y'all don't support nobody. For John Grell Jones, bro. That that that's what that pissed me off. Let's be real. With why it. don't we have? Y'all know I'm supporting nobody. Just see it. Why don't I want to watch party for John Kell Jones? Because she's a, be- she's a behemoth in the finals. Why we can't just watch anybody? Why we don't watch Buddy Hill? Why we don't have watch parties Bro. for DeAndre Ayton? Stop, stop, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. They never get that far. Relax. Stop it. Relax. Relax, bro. No, no, they ain't leaks. They ain't ever get to the finals. Why we not none for Rick Fox? They ain't in the finals. Why we not none for Michael Thompson? <laughs> Nigga, I know I wasn't alive back then. I just said it. He was alive, but he just. Why we don't have none for Clay? It is what it is. But. We Play do what we do watch. We do watch the finals. Watch parties. But why isn't we why do we have a watch, watch party for the WNBA finals? A, a, a you, you WNBA player is in the finals, bro. <laughs> a behemoth WNBA player is in the finals. Why we don't have a watch party for that? Chance. Why why have to be the finals? Why y'all, can't so y'all already to know. Listen, y'all already know we can talk about stage. it in the next episode. That means we need. It is what it is. Experts need to throw a watch party going forward. Experts, experts, watch party note. Coming we to your throw life. and watch parties for our Bahamian counterparts. And it's not just basketball. We got Sean A running. We can support all our Bahamian athletes. Oh, yeah. Shout out Sean A. Miller, man. Yeah, she not just Sean A. Stephen Gardner. Ooh, ooh, ooh. He, she it, went to 400. That was good. All man. those guys and ladies who are out there um, supporting our country and putting us on the world stage, we have watch parties for all of them. All right. If you didn't watch parties, it can make a difference. It ain't going to make no difference, but it ain't going to be a right. shout out. It ain't going to make no difference either. But then she might say, hey, that's your boy, X Factor. Anyway. <laughs> but anyway, it is what it is. All type of relevant <laughs> foolishness now. Yeah, we agree. Right. Here from the experts, you know Sanzo Matic for Thumb Thumb. X Factor, <laughs> Showtime. Wait. Thank you for your time. We we'll see you guys Shout next time. Shout out Thumb Thumb, let's be Experts out. <laughs> next week. Next week, baby.